What is up guys? This is Tony with Lazy Tech TV and thank you so much for your patience. We've been on a hiatus for a little bit and as you can see, we're in the brand new Slanty Studios here in California and I am so excited to be bringing more and more videos to you guys from this exact location. Long story short, a lot of things have changed, but nevertheless, we are back, we're here and we're ready to talk tech. Now, the first thing I want to talk about of 2019 is something that one might argue is the best piece of technology in the world, and the majority of everyone else would say, no, you're wrong, and that is this Flex View. Now, as you can tell, right from the get-go, right from the picture on the box, this seems like one of those frivolous, one of those one-off, when would you ever use this and who would ever buy it? Well, it was five bucks, so this guy bought it. And the cool thing is, or maybe not cool, but the interesting thing is, this company that made this is the same company that made the Nuckies. If you haven't seen the Nuckies video, go ahead and check that out in that link over there. We'll put it in the description down below. It's basically a company that tried to compete against the pop socket, but in any event, the Flex View, or sorry, the Flexi View, there's an, there's an I in there, essentially allows you to have a hands-free smartphone holder while you're laying in bed, if you need a stand. Uh, the whole thing, well, here it is. It's this guy right here. And the whole thing is made up of very cheap, very inexpensive kind of malleable cable here with the back, neck of the back brace so it doesn't irritate your neck while you're using it, especially while you're in bed. And then this is the clamp that rotates on a gimbal, but then it opens and closes depending on the size of your phone. Now, what I first thought was, oh, I'm gonna have to take my phone out of the case. No, at least for me, that wasn't the case. No, no pun intended. So I, I have got a Pixel 3 here. I'm not gonna lie, it's not super simple, but it's also not impossible. Hello? My case also has a pop socket, so that's why it's, it's like that. Okay, so essentially you put it in the case, clamps down, you can still access everything from the front. Fingerprint reader, at least on this phone is well, it's impossible, so you have to use the uh, whatever you use to unlock your phone. And then you get to position these cables however you want. And now I could, if I wanted to, I could walk around like this. And I'm hands-free and watching Doctor Who or whatever and... Uh, yeah, and I can do other things, you know, make food or do some work on the computer or feed my kids because, you know, Doctor Who is important, but kids kids are very, very important too, but, you know, TV shows. Uh, yeah, so for five bucks, this is one of those novelty gifts. I wouldn't necessarily call it a gag gift because it's not a gag. This is a very true product uh, that's not necessarily meant to be taken in jest. It's not meant to be taken as a joke because there are definite situations where you want to be hands-free. I mean, come on, you got to admit, there's times in the past where you're holding your phone and maybe falling asleep and the phone falls on your, on your face and hits the bridge of your nose and then you've broken your nose. I mean, that happens to us at least once a month, right? So this would alleviate that and I thought you know, the amount of times that I fall asleep watching Netflix, this actually might be useful for me. Um, but then also, um, that back brace, the, the, the little padding that's supposed to, you know, help your neck, not so much. Actually, it hurted. Hurted? That's a word, right? It hurt a lot. Like the day after, I've tried this a number of times, and while just laying in bed, relaxing, after a long day at work, got my beer next to me, just chilling, watching some tunes, 
Watching some tunes, who the heck says that? Watching some shows, this is fine. However, if you fall asleep with it on, which you can, which I did uh, at least twice, um, the next morning, this this part, your the back of your neck, it's gonna feel it. It's gonna hurt. It's gonna feel like you have a crink in your neck, and take a few hours or a few ibuprofen to to alleviate that pain. So keep that in mind. It's it's not pain free. It's hands free. They don't promise any pain free. Just hands free. Um, but even with it on, I'm not gonna put it back. But even with it on, while like actually accessing the phone menus and everything, the clamps. They don't get in the way. The phone menus are still there. If your phone doesn't rotate, make sure you turn rotation lock off. And I don't know, the, the, the fundamentals of what this offers is, is, is quite ingenious. I mean, this is very simple and it does exactly what it's supposed to do. It's just, it's just kind of, well, again, you wouldn't walk around with it. Um, you probably don't want to show it off to your friends. Uh, maybe, I don't know, maybe that's your kind of thing to show off. Um, and uh, yeah, whatever other activity you might want to use this for. I mean, they even promote it as a stand because you could stand it up. Ta-da, I did it. It only took me two minutes to figure it out. Whatever. But again, five, five measly, actually it was less than $5. It was like $4.88 at uh, Walmart. So so you're, you're gonna know like the, uh, brace or the padding I mean that's that's fraying already and then the actual plastic sheath that the coil goes in I mean that's already starting to bend and you know give way so you can't expect the best of the best if you're paying five dollars I mean for what it is it's it's you know it's kind of cool I could see it also being useful on a flight you know if you're on a plane and you don't have a lot of room and you want to keep your hands free, but you still want to watch your tunes. Why am I saying that? You still want to watch your shows while you're on your flight, so you throw this on, watch your show, and you know get a lot of weird looks. But hey, it's either that or throw your VR goggles on. So either or, you're gonna look weird. It's kind of crazy how useful it can be if you think about it. There are a few sacrifices, mainly the pain issue that I felt with this. Maybe I shouldn't just fall asleep with it on. That's a personal issue. However, as it is, for $5 to be hands-free in particular situations, not everything, obviously you don't wanna do this while driving, but to be hands-free for only five bucks, works with all smartphones. I don't know, if you can find it, give it a try. It's, it's, actually, it's actually really not that bad. So if you want to know more, links as always can be found in the description down below. If you have any questions or comments, please leave that in the comment section down below. Make sure you're following us here on YouTube, like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit that bell. We're also on Facebook, YouTube, I already said that. We're also on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and soon we'll be in your ears because we might be bringing back the podcast. That's exciting. But stay tuned for that, and we'll see you in the next one. Wait.